All right. I have several updates and thoughts, all game related, that I'd like to get out, but let's start off with some action today. I fought this guy a couple times and he seems very fun, so decided to save it for recording. He's got a couple moves that give me all kinds of trouble. That's one of them. I hate that stomp. And then I've only I got to the uh, second phase and he turns into a damn angel with a serpent tail. And he killed me with that that time. That one's fun. I like the timing on that. I'll take that all day. Okay, here we go. No good. Getting caught by that stomp is the worst. And then I'm terrified because he's got a really long uh, Estus Punish move. That's what killed me. Yeah, that's what killed me the first time I got to this phase. Is that move right there. I'm, I'm scared of it. I feel so much more confident parrying now that I've got this golden shield for some reason. I really like it. The 69 defense. That's what it is. It's just nice. It's just nice. That's fun, man. Oh, no, 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 no. No tail, no tail. Heck yes. Heck yes. That actually may be one of my favorite fights so far. I really enjoyed that. I like that guy's moveset a lot. It was just a very satisfying fight to me. I like that guy. Let's see what this is though. This is really neat. Both the lore and just the spell. An aspect of the primordial crucible where all life was once blended together. The more I play this game, the more I feel sorry for everyone who has to make video games after this. The sheer density of exploration, the, the content per square foot in this game is absolutely insane. This is the Divine Tower of Caelid. I feel like in the grand scheme of things, this is probably not a big deal, but I had such a fun time finding this place, figuring out how to get to this point, and then dropping down through these levels and actually sneaking for the first time because the enemies here were very tough. And dude, it was just such a good experience, the whole thing. Uh, the boss at the bottom of this was basically impossible for me, so I haven't taken him on yet or I haven't defeated him yet. 
I just kind of wanted to document this. That's how I'm seeing this video series now at this point is just a documentation of my first playthrough of Elden Ring. I wish I had some of my thoughts and feelings as I was going through the Souls games the first time. So that's what I'm doing now. I have no delusions of making this an entertaining video series or anything like that. It's, there's just too much and too little time. I've not even stepped foot into Stormvale Castle yet, but I'll be doing that in just a few minutes after another quick recap of some of the things that I've done. I've done a lot of exploring off camera, mainly just riding and hitting uh, grace fires. I've done very little in the way of actual progression, uh, but I have explored quite a lot and just unlocked a lot of the map. I've fought no major bosses that I know of. Um, about the only things that I've fought that you won't see are a couple of the guys in the boats that drop the death rot. Uh, and maybe like one or two small dungeon bosses, but nothing major at all. I'm going to be slowing down, hitting Stormvale Castle soon, and I'm really excited about it. I found this guy, but I have not opened this door yet. And after I rescued him, I jumped on top of him with my horse. And uh, my horse had a seizure and then I died, so that was fun. Oh, no, 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 no. This is bad. This is so bad. This is so bad. <laughs> how do I... How do I... How do I not do this? Well, I tried quitting game, but that did not work. So it seems that whatever quest that Mr. Alexander here was going to send me on has been failed. And I'll save it for another time. Uh, so now I'm just going to kill him. I mean, uh, I'm, there might be a way to like get forgiveness, but I, I'm a believer that you got to deal with the consequences of your mistakes. gonna I would at least like to kill you the way that I pissed you off by uh, jumping on top of your of your pilot lid come here this is so not worth it but I just feel like I have to do it That's pretty funny. And all I'm left with of Alexander is a talisman. But it does boost the attack power of skills, which I use a lot. So, I mean, I'm not happy about it. I wish I would have got to see the, uh, the rest of the quest line. But things happen. Sometimes you mess around and murder a dude. Sometimes that dude is a pot. I do still want to find out. How to get here, though. Okay, well, I found the area where I could have saved Mr. Alexander had I not pissed him off and then killed him. And I've also found a giant stone lava breathing lizard that, uh, was absolutely wrecking me. Or at least did the first two times. Put this on, but I think I'm switching back. In memory of Alexander, I'm gonna go to the, uh, the pot shard. Try to do this with my 
bloody slash. For safety. Oh, why didn't that hit? Bloody slash for the win. Dragonheart and Moonvel. turned out to be quite an intense little excursion that I found myself on. cool. Hold up, what is this? Yo, I'm kind of liking this. I may have to try this out. So I think it was Kale that gave me this finger snap emote and told me to find and there was something about I just remember the word mist and it was about finding a like a wolf howl the source of a wolf howl and using that emote 
So I've come to this Mistwood ruins to see if maybe this was the place. The name's Blythe. I'm looking for a man who goes by Darrowell. He fled somewhere nearby. Or so I've heard. Come tell me if you find him before I do. I can offer you ample reward. Darrowell. Blyde. And Mistwood is looking for Darrowell. Oh, that was easier to find than I expected. You might have heard of me. Kenneth Height. Next in line is the rightful ruler of Limgrave. Okay, so that wasn't Kenneth. Oh, Kenneth is still alive. You my boy, Kenneth. I think I already did with that, though. What's this kind, sir? Remarkable. The knight commander yep. dead. Already. I did it. I thought it was you. <laughs> hmm. You seem a little overconfident, but... I'm too interested to see what this does. I must begin my search post haste for a true and stalwart lord of the proper lineage to take the reins of Limgrave. Huh. Just don't quite know what to think about this Kenneth character here. I've been doing lots of exploring and lots of procrastinating actually going into Stormville Castle. So, it's time to change that. I have not been past this point right here yet and I'm stoked about it I'm gonna slow down explore this place thoroughly I'm using a twin blade blood infused with a Reduvia as a backup I've got a small shield with storm wall medium shield with barricade I love the shield abilities in this game I love that I never have to block I can just use those abilities Got a few spells, but nothing that I am loving too much. I'm still looking for some spells that make me excited. The question is, who is he Rogier then? If he's even Rogier than Roger, I mean... Might have to think about using him. Uh-oh. Foul tarnished. In search of the Elder Ring. Emboldened by the flame of ambition. Dude's got a... Ugly nose on him. Someone must extinguish thy flame. Let it be Margaret the Fell. Oh, damn. I've got. Uh. I bought that item. Please stop. I don't know where it is, though. It's here. Briefly binds Margaret once imprisoned to Earth. I don't know what it means, but maybe we'll find out. Margaret, the fell omen. I was expecting Margaret to be a, a lady. Seems slow. Slow but tricky. Big delays, though. Big delays. Damn, big delays. Well, 
power has a passing skill. Warrior blood must truly run in thy veins. Dude, that was fun. That was so fun. Those delays though. Those delayed attacks were intense. The bleed just helps so much. Those bleed procs are like gigantic. That was dope. I wasn't expecting a... Uh... I, I forgot to use the item. I, I got so caught up. I forgot to use the item. Yeah. Well, damn. That was good, though, man. All the fights have been so good so far. Okay, so now... Now... Have I gained entry into Stormbelt? Yes. Yes. That makes me happy. Secrets already. I'm just gonna spend all the time I want exploring every inch of this place. And uh, I'm going to edit out times when like, I spend an unnecessary amount of time and don't really find anything. Those are easy to do because I can just make a loud pop noise after I waste a lot of time and I know to go there and edit out everything before it. This is so cool looking. Try the opening right here. Guards don't know about it. You'll breach the castle undetected. Hmm. Sure. You're just the kind of tarnish that I like. I pray for your success. But can I change my mind now? I want to do both. I want to try the hard way. And then take the sneaky way.
really like the uh, Reduvia for flying enemies. Very, very useful right there. Those guys are kind of fun to fight. One more strength, and I'll have enough to one hand that cross weapon. Constantly have like <laughs> the, the uh, I call it the the exploration tingles in this game. It, it's it's really overwhelming, honestly. Just the uh, the fact that everywhere you look, you know you can go to, and everything looks so cool. It's a very hard game to commentate, honestly, because my brain's always just tied up in a pretzel. critical C dex I've been I've been thinking about leveling up a dagger as a crit weapon there's a couple just the basic dagger seems like the uh, like the right move but I may have to play with this I like claws, and I like daggers. I love that.
Okay, I gotta drop on that dude out there. I'm gonna go ahead and see what. Oh man. That was a bad job. Good, sir. Hey. Like, 100% of the time, if I get cocky, if I hit a parry or something the first try, and I get cocky, I, I never don't pay for it. The immediate moments after any form of shit-talking are always so, so bad. Okay, I was uh, glad it's a dead end. That was kind of cool. I like that. I think that just leaves... Unless that changed something out here. That just leaves... The area to drop down here. Or maybe that rusty key opens the other door too. Just let me play my games. Thank you. I put that spell on specifically for that kind of purpose. Wait a minute, what's the point of this?
not real sure what that was. I think to get that item, I'll have to come from up above. I don't see a way to get it from here. What a loser I am. What an absolute failure. attack was disheartening to say the least. No, you didn't. You did not. What a klutz. What a klutz I am. Alright, how about... Can I go straight over this? Oh, you... Is this droppable? Definitely looks like it. Okay, I got an item out there.
Wow. Killed by a flappy bird on stilts. That's kind of a bummer. Oh, thank you. I chose the wrong way last time. But now I gotta go back up. Revenge. the platforming that's built into the levels. I, I think it's very well done. Enhances jump attacks and the curved sword enhances guard counters. Okay. Okay. Already got one. Let's see how many I have. Six. Oh, yeah. Definitely doing that. Oh, is that the. Is that the thing that I fought? Is that the intro boss? I think it is. name I don't think this is him it's it's it may be it's at least something very similar But uh, I don't think you can actually parry him. I think I made that way harder than it was supposed to be. Just because I was intimidated. I can't forget that stone key door. This looks like it's going to be a lot of exploration. Um, okay, this looks like maybe we got two different elevators. 
up top. So this looks like I found one of them. Okay, still got this way. Don't know which way is the correct way, but I'm going to keep chasing this path, I think. That's pretty brutal. Kinda cool. I like this one too. I'll rock it for a little bit, even though it doesn't match. The uh, the lady, uh, Rodrika, I think her name is, tells you about. I think it's Godric grafting people, taking their arms and legs and heads. There's definitely some really cool and brutal stuff going on in Stormvale Castle. Jesus Christ Almighty. <laughs> what did I tell you? What did I tell you? One one cocky word. One cocky sentiment at all. I get wrecked every time. Okay, let's try this again, but better. That's what I'm talking about. Cool. Get off me. cheese strats on that dude from up here. Oh, there's so many ways I've got to backtrack and go. Can I shoot this down? Alright, this is that door that was locked. Yes. Makes me think I'm going the right way. Excellent. Excellent. I love when I find a stone sword key in an area with a with a door. Sure. Let's check this out.
I think that just gives more customization for the weapon arts. Which is even cooler. Cool stuff, cool stuff, cool stuff. What do we got? Another dagger. I love daggers. Not as good of a deck scaling, but 140. I may have found my critical weapon. I have this and the claws. One of those are going to be my new secondary, I think. I wonder if you can put the weapon art determination on it. I think that's the name of it. That makes the uh, next attack do more damage. If you could do that and then get a parry and a crit, that might be sweet. deserve that. I think I could have definitely got here without using that stone sword key somehow. Okay, we got uh, another ballista. Bring it, men. Let's have at it. If I die, it's going to be because I killed myself because these dudes are chumps. Pike, magic grease, golden rune, exile armor, smoldering butterfly, golden rune. Okay, that looks promising for a, for a way to go. Oh, we got a big guy over here I missed. I like that guy. That was fun. Oh no! No! 
No, he needs to break that. <laughs> oh man, this place is huge. This place is so huge. Okay, I hope he respawns because that's the first thing I'm doing. The first thing I'm doing is going back and... Hmm... This, this place is ridiculous. Wait. Wait. Did I? I don't think I hit that, Grace. I just thought about hitting it. That was real dumb. <laughs> uh, okay, up. Yes, up, because I can come back down, but I can't go back up. these bats. What was the point of coming up? There's got to be a point. Looks like I might can drop down into here from somewhere else, but not go up yet though. Starting to get my tactics down for like certain, like anything. Anything large, but not too large. Like that rat or like that big guy that I fought just a couple minutes ago. Um, barricade. Barricade and strong attack is the way to go. 100%. Okay, well, uh, terrible stuff is definitely going to happen there. You don't get that many items laid around without something very mean and angry nearby. Ulcerated tree, just like in the uh, the bottom part of the first area, which I've never killed. I wonder. Uh, I'd like to survive. Get get out. I'm about to get hit from the back, though. Um. of death's pustule. Alright, well I'm definitely dying right here.
Wow. I, I cannot, I cannot believe. I cannot believe that uh, uh, I made it out of there. It doesn't, I don't, I don't feel like I deserved it. I don't feel like I deserved to make it out of there after uh, forgetting. Oh yes, oh yes. That would have been freaking hilarious if that dropped right. <laughs> if that drop would have killed me right there. <laughs> Why won't you smash this? Okay, obviously it's not him. Something else. Something else has to smash it. What could it be? This game is so fun, man. This game is so fun to play. I love playing Elden Ring. Shortcut number two. I believe so. How the hell do I uh, break this thing, though? What's bigger than that, dude? Show me. Are you? Oh. This grafting of Godric's ill befits a lord. He's tainted the very winds. Yeah, that crotch protection is serious right there. I need me some of that. If you intend to challenge Godric, I ask you call upon me. The winds run foul with his deeds. I'm certain father would permit me aid the fight. Uh, that sounds nice, and I'm sure that we could have a good quest line together, but I work alone. Very nice. Oh, you're who I need. You are who I need. Come with me, sir. I need your assistance. stay alive. I should have took should have taken this guy out first. Oh, there we go. Probably not worth, but uh it, I did it. This is definitely not worth now. fighting these. I love fighting that dude. Oh man, that was intense. That was fun. I like, I, I, I'm, I'm happy about all that. It probably wasn't worth the effort, but that was real, that was real fun. Okay, we have a uh, boss room. We have boss room, but I have multiple things, multiple ways. Oh, we got a grace right here. Easy peasy. Got a uh, little dude I definitely want to get right here. Right 
Are these little pots like the equivalent of the little mushroom people in Dark Souls 1? If I, uh, if I mess with them, is Mama right here gonna wake up? What if I jump on top of their heads? I think I'm an enemy to the jar, people. Just unequivocally. Oh, speaking of which, there was one of those witch ladies. Uh, at the end of one of the bridges that kind of looked like Yoel from Dark Souls 3. Like the pilgrim dude. That told me I needed to snatch something from the big pot. Actually, hang on. In my notes it says, Michaela's Blessing snatch it from the big pot and that came from I called her the bridge pilgrim and west the ones that like tell you they want to read your hands or whatever found a few of those so I gotta go see what that's about I know where the big pot is but he wouldn't talk to me when I went there the first time and I don't know don't know if snatch it from him means uh kill him or if there's a way to successfully talk to him. I feel like I hear a blacksmith. I need to find that. Um, bird or the dude first. That's not what I meant to do. That is, though. Okay, 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 okay. Can you be parried? I don't know. Thinking, I'm thinking no. Okay, okay, okay. I feel ya. I feel ya. You're a hefty guy. Cool armor. Big sword. Good crotch protection. But I'll be back for you. Okay, maybe I'll get the item this time before I engage. Correct. Banished knight armor altered. But it's heavy as hell. That's excellent. Ah, uh, yeah. Why not? Let's take a whack at this. Alright, off to a bad start. No, off to a terrible start. That's the wrong potion. This is bad.
interesting reward. Bloody Slash is too good, man. Even on things that don't bleed, it's just the damage is ridiculous. I don't mean to be dirty minded, but tell me this thing doesn't have vaginas for eyes and a nipple on his forehead. <laughs>